right. Good afternoon, Good afternoon. Callum. Good afternoon, Danielle. Happy summer. How are you? Uh, fantastic. It's a beautiful day. We got our sunglasses on. Yeah. Wanted to do a little quick video and just talk a little bit about interviewing your realtor and your mortgage broker. Why it's a good idea, why people do it. So why? important, right? Yeah. I, mean, it's a, I often say to clients, it's a meshing of personalities uh, and you've got, to, uh, you've got to be happy with you, who you're working with when arguably you're making the biggest uh, purchase or investment you're, you're ever going to make in your lifetime, so far at least. Absolutely, yeah. Whenever we meet with clients, we always recommend speaking to at least two or three different real estate agents. It's like you said, Callum, it's a good idea to get a sense of who they are, how they work, what their track record is. At the end of the day, it has to be the right fit, right? So you want to select someone who is a good communicator, who you know, you like, you trust. It's a good idea to get a referral from someone. So. Yeah, we thought we'd talk about a few different interview questions that you can ask your realtor and or mortgage broker. Callum, can you maybe give us a few examples of some questions that people ask you when they sit down with you kind of in an interview style appointment? Absolutely. So, I mean, some of the some of the key questions that come across from uh, from not just new buyers, but buyers alike is, you know, who are the lenders that, that I work with? Uh, and of course, I'm working with uh, cross-section to lenders, whether it's banks, whether it's credit unions, whether it's uh, online lenders or more virtual lenders. So we've got the whole gambit that mm -hmm. way. And it's that's super important as well because and I, and I often flip the script on my clients is if you were to, you know, if you're going to invest half a million dollars or if you had half a million dollars to invest, you know, it's just as important to be so thorough. Mm -hmm. So again, with respect to lenders, who you're working with, what is your level of expertise? How long have you, have you, how have you been in the business? Do you work with, you know, uh, uh, first time home buyers? Do you work with, or do you do refinances? Are you, are you doing a, a, the whole, the whole swath a, a right. of, uh, of borrowers? You know, how do I find the best rates? Uh, you know, do you do we do we look at online lenders, which of course we do, and what are the details that we get into with respect to those mortgage products? And we always go into uh, into much greater depth. It's not just a, it, you know, rate is so important, but it's not just about rate. It's about payment flexibility. Can you make extra payments? Certainly in this market, what if I want to buy up and take my mortgage with me? Can I port my mortgage? Right. So many aspects. Yeah. Right. That makes sense because at the end of the day. Right. You're not just choosing the mortgage broker, but you're choosing the lender. And it's good to know what sort of options you have out there. Absolutely. And what kind of you know, support is there after we do the mortgage? Right. I, as a mortgage broker, I am the, the middle person. But what does that mean to to the borrower? Do I just put you cast you out into the into the ship into the sea and say right. goodbye? Yeah. And that's the furthest thing from it. We're there all the way through the mortgage term because we want to speak to you again at renewal time or we are mid uh, mid renewal time. If we need to revisit some of the numbers or the rates or or options that we put into in place, we want to have those clients back. And, you know, we like to think of ourselves as your as your mortgage professional for life. Right. Uh, so, yeah, great. Yeah, we do the we have the same mentality uh, as realtors. You know, when we start working with a client, uh, the hope is that we can assist their friends, family members, purchases down the road, and all that. So that's a common theme. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it, those are your your your, your market experts, right? Mm -hmm. we've, got, we've got you on the real estate side. I'm on the financing side. We add another uh, level to that, which would be a great uh, a great lawyer. Great home inspector. We've got you know when you've got a, a, a putting a team all together. It's so important mm -hmm. to have the people that you that you can rely upon, that you trust on, uh, and that have that, that level of expertise. Great. Well, thanks for all that info. Though that was good uh, information. Always happy to give you to to impart some information. That's for sure. Awesome. Thanks for tuning into our video, and look forward to doing the next one with Callum and Danielle's Victoria Real Estate Edge.